So I just wanted to show you guys iOS 7 in the car. They've made some changes. So before you'd have to unlock specifically right here. You can only swipe there. Now you can do it anywhere from anywhere. It's a lot better now for me because my knob's in the way here in park. So obviously we have our controls down here now. For the Wi-Fi, airplane mode, all of that. Multitasking has changed a little bit. Kill the applications by swiping up, as you know. They did change the music though, I don't like this at all, look at this. So before, with that view, we could swipe left and right. So when you're driving, it makes it a lot easier, right, to see, to change the, the song. But now that doesn't work anymore. Now you have to go find it down here and play it or pause it, which is okay. But I did notice, I did recently find out that there's a, another music app that works really well. And I'm going to show you that application in a moment here. So there's another music app that I like. It's called Leech Tunes. And not only does it look better, you have the artwork here and also kind of blurred out in the background. You can change. It's got all these different settings you can change. But now it works like it did before with the regular stock music app. So we can tap and it'll start playing. Volume up and down by swiping up and down. Not in the car because of my system, but in other cars or in other, in other uses. And the swiping works. Now rocking with the best. Just blaze. So it makes it a lot easier while we're driving just to touch it and swipe it. And then you can use two fingers also to fast forward. Swipe to the right with two fingers. Hey, oh, you feel me? So I think that works a lot better. I don't, I don't even have to look at it. I can just touch it and keep my eyes on the road. Safety first, boys and girls. Thank you.